A big day for schools after two years of distance learning and masking up today. The mask came on for most students. Lisa Balick check in with several schools today to see how it all went. She joins us live from Southeast Portland. Lisa. Yeah, it was kind of interesting, Jeff. We checked in at a lot of schools and talked to kids as they came out of school, talked with some of the staff inside, and we found there were a lot more kids keeping the mask on than you probably would have expected. And the reason was, well, there were actually a lot of reasons why. Great, I didn't have to wear masks. Freedom to choose now offered in most Oregon and Washington schools when it comes to wearing a mask. But with COVID still here, spring break coming up, many still choosing to mask up. Sarah Lopez has four kids from preschool to high school. The youngest had to wear a mask, the others chose to. Their reasoning is just, you know, it's comfortable for them. They're kind of used to it. At several schools, we found at least half, if not more, the students and staff still wearing a mask and respecting each other's choices. People, like, didn't, they were mad at other people in, uh, for their choices, so I think that went well. Distancing still practice in many schools. At Arlita Elementary, you have to sit at lunchtime in a marked spot three feet from someone else. COVID tests available at all schools. If you test positive, you have to stay home for five days. Teachers here at Arlita have just worked with kids to really explain to them why this change is happening and to support them in making the choice with their family. The Park Row School District decided to keep masks required this week. They'll be optional when the students come back from spring break. After two years, students everywhere have learned a lot about how to live with a virus threat. When I'm talking like really close to people right now, I might want to like I want to be at least like two feet. But if I'm like looking at people's Pokemon cards or stuff like that, then I'm just going to pull up my mask. Now, what will be interesting is as the week goes on, whether or not we will see more kids taking that mask off as they feel more comfortable. We'll be checking in the coming weeks to see how it's going. Back to you.